if you're speeding, not wearing a seatbelt, or driving drunk, expect to see blue police lights in your rearview mirror. We will be looking for people driving under the influence of alcohol. If you're going to drink, we encourage you again to have a good time. But go out and get you a designated driver, make a plan, have some place to stay, get you someone to drive for you. Beginning Thursday, state troopers will be on Alabama roads cracking down on careless drivers. The enforcement includes DUI checkpoints, saturation patrols, and troopers will be using radar guns with laser detection to catch speeders. In 2012, nine people were killed during the July 4th holiday weekend in Alabama. 30 people were arrested for driving under the influence, and state troopers handed out more than 3,000 speeding tickets. Marilyn Broderick says her family's safety is a top priority. She's staying in town for the holiday, but still plans to be careful. It's very important because there's lots of people out. Everybody's going to parties. Everybody's out having a good time. Everybody's looking for those, those social events. But, of course, it makes sense. You want to be safe. You don't want to have it end in tragedy and end up in a hospital. State troopers hope that every family will follow that example. We could, we could write tickets, and tickets certainly uh, make an impression in terms of what we're doing in enforcement. But our goal is to go out and educate the public, and that's why we're here talking to you guys. We want to educate the public. In Huntsville, Brittany Williams, Way 31, First News.